This is Orville Wright. Orville Wright's great, 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 great grandson. And Orville doesn't say a lot. Orville's a quiet, he's a strong, quiet type. They're just, uh, they're very polite. They were at the last event and they're here to, um, are you going to be singing tonight? No. Okay, well you should be. We'll work on that for the next Lincoln Day. <laughs> Governor for the great state of Ohio. Now, folks, if we can educate our kids, if we can retrain our workers for the jobs that we have today and the jobs that are coming tomorrow, if we can reduce the tax burden and get regulations that make common sense, that reflect the values of Ohio, and if, in fact, we can fix our workers' comp system and then have a mindset that any obstacle that is in the way of creating a job must be torn down. Then we create an environment where it will work. They don't come any better than that. He's, he's great. I hope he gets in. Our problem is we have priced ourselves out of business. We have signs up on the border that tells people who are thinking about coming here to go away. Now, I'm going to suggest to you that the heartbeat of any economy is the small business person. I'm going to have business people in my cabinet, and they're going to understand that the heroes in this culture are the small businessmen and women that create the jobs. And if they don't get it, they're not going to stay there. We're all such small business owners, so we are really looking for the tax cut for small businesses. We certainly would like to hire more people and not fire anyone. Now, people today say if there's anything we need is we need term limits for politicians. Well, I'll tell you what we need more than that. We need our public officials to get the heck out and go get an experience earning a living and making a little money and paying the taxes and understanding how this free market works. That would make them better politicians. That's what they need. We as Republicans, conservatives in the state of Ohio have a job to do, and we believe John Kasich is the person we need in the, in the governorship. I will fight every day when we improve this atmosphere to travel this state and travel this world if I have to, to bring prosperity back and sell the great state of Ohio. We've got great people, great location, great geography, and great assets. We're going to take advantage of it, aren't we? And we're going to restore the hope and the prosperity.